Hi G, I just want to wish you well in college and whatever else you decide to do with your life because no matter what, I know you'll be successful. Thanks so much for being one of the people I look up to most in this dorm and making it part of what made Culver feel like a home to me. Love you lots. Hi Gianna, um, thank you so much for everything this year. You were always there to listen to me. You were always knew exactly what to say and you always gave the best advice and told the best stories. I remember one night on Friday, I was in your room um, and it was pretty late and I still have pictures of you like making weird faces from like underneath the blanket so all I could see is your like face and you were just making the weirdest faces but we were sitting in the dark so like if I turned the flash on it made you look like really funny. Um, yeah, and that's one of my favorite memories. Hey Felita, I love you so much and I've had a wonderful time spending time with you this year and all the stupid stuff that we get up to together and I'm gonna miss you so much, you're gonna do great at RIT. Hey Felina, um, I'm gonna miss you so much. I know you're just gonna do absolutely amazing at RIT. You're gonna be such a sick goalie with those sick pads and sick gear. Um, you're such a funny, amazing person and I can't wait to go to your wedding. Um, Please remember me, so love you so much. And Tegan, make sure to invite Tegan and I to your wedding. Hi, Stell. Hey. I just wanted to say I'm really appreciative that you've been my roommate for the past three years, and you've really stuck with me no matter what. Um, so with that being said, I wish you the very best of luck at Hobart and Williams next year. And I'm really proud of you. Have fun. I just wanted to say that being best friends with you for the last two years has been an incredible experience and although we'll be spending the summer together, I can't believe our journey is almost ending but I know next year you'll have an amazing time and it'll be weird to be separated but I hope that we still talk a lot. Love you. Love you! Bye! Hi Kit, um, when I first met you, you actually scared the crap out of me. I thought you were going to shank me. Uh, you didn't shank me so that's already a great start. Um, I really appreciated you and everything. I love talking to you all night, even though I was just rambling about nothing. I love doing a whole John Mulaney skit for you, which you told my parents about after I got crested. Um, I'm really going to miss you. I would not be the person that I am today if it wasn't for you, and I really appreciate that. Hey Mo, I'm so proud of you for making it this far and graduating. We have so many good memories together and I'm not gonna get into all of them now, but you've been one of my closest friends, dare I say my best friend while I've been at Culver and I can't wait to watch you move on in life and have a wonderful time at Case Western. I'm so proud of you, I love you so much. Mwah. So, no. love you, you're my sister and I don't really have to say more. Hey Mo, I appreciate all the fun times that we shared in Zoe's room and I'm gonna miss you. Hi Lainey, thank you for being one of the best seniors in the dorm. I'll always remember how you would go to my room and like tuck me in every night. Um, I wish you the best luck in college, you're gonna do great and I'll always remember you. I love you. Hi Lainey, I just want to say how much I appreciate you and I wish we would have gotten closer last year because you mean so much to me and some of my favorite memories are from Florida and I hope you do well in college and I know you will and I'll always be there cheering you on in rugby in the stands. I'll be there and we miss you so much. Lainey, thanks so much for being my big sister this year. It was so great getting to meet you and have like you be the one of the first piece people I ever knew at Benson. You made it into a home and I really appreciate you for that. So have a great whatever you do in the future and stay positive is what I love about you. Okay, um, Lainey, you're genuinely one of the nicest people I've ever met and you were one of the first returning girls to like reach out to me and just you're filled with so much kindness and it's like it's so hard not to smile when someone's around you and you're seriously one of the nicest people I've ever met and I love you so much and I wish you the best in college and you're gonna do great. I love you. Hi, Hi Sarah. Sarah. Um, we just I just wanted to we wanted to say that we love you and we're gonna miss you so much mm -hmm. and you were just have been and are such a great friend and I'm gonna miss you so much. Please don't leave me. Please don't no, leave us. Don't forget to email us. 
and DM me mm -hmm. and still send me TikToks. Yeah, like our TikToks too. Yeah. <laughs> and no, but we actually love you so much. Yes, so. and there's just too many memories that we've had together. Like, I, there isn't just one specific moment, but I just I'm so grateful that you're our friend and we love you we love forever. You. We miss you. Hi, I'm him. Hi, I'm Sophia, and, and this, this is, is our, our favorite, favorite memory of Sarah Jane. Jane. <laughs> Mine is when I remember when your older sister, Rin, introduced me to you. And I was like, I'm gonna like her. My favorite memory of you, Sarah, is when you picked me up in your car from my house, and we drove around the lake, like, I don't know how many times, and then we s sang a bunch of songs, and like, it was really fun. So, yes, yeah, really I, we're gonna miss you. We're gonna miss you so much. So much! <laughs> Hi May, it's Ava and I just wanted to wish you congratulations on your graduation from Culver and I just want to say thank you so much for everything you've done in the years I've been here at Culver. It's been an honor getting to know you and the person I've seen you become has just been absolutely amazing. I know you're going to do such amazing things at High Point um, on the pre-med track. I can't wait to see what college brings you and um, how you're going to go so far in life. And I've loved getting to know you. I'm going to miss you so much. And please come back to visit whenever. Love you so much, May. Bye. Hello, May, I'm Rebecca. And first, congratulations for graduation. And you're really, really a good, great big sister. And I will always remember the time that we have family and you really really helped me a lot when I was just a new freshman and at the beginning of the school you really helped me a lot and I will always remember that I'll miss you after you leave and please remember please remember to contact me whenever you want and thank you so much hey May I remember like the first day when I was when I first came here it was during the international parade you asked me if you wanted like we could go for a walk sometime and we never did but i'm really excited to do it this weekend and i know like it'll be really special because we waited like the entire year okay hey may um i don't know if you know this but when i came here in eighth grade for a tour and you were one of the leaders that were walking me around you were most of the reason why i came to culver because i just thought I thought you were so confident and you were so kind and I'm so thankful that I got to be in the same dorm as you and you continued giving me that endless kindness and I wish you so well <laughs> in college and I know you're going to do great. Hi Alice, I already did one for you but you know I'll do another one because you're my big sister and I love you, you know that. You know when I first got here we had the same suitcase, I was adorable. Um, what else? Thank you for helping me with everything, especially like the move out box and stuff. That was confusing. I also have more questions about that. I'm gonna go find you later, so I'm gonna miss you so much. Have the best life. Hi, Hi Alice. Alice. We're gonna miss you a lot. I'm gonna miss you a lot. I'm gonna miss you a lot. You're one of my best friends here, and I love you. And I hope you have fun at Wesley. And I'm gonna miss you coming into our room yes. and just chilling in here. And we love you a lot and it was always fun laughing with you. <laughs> and we're gonna miss you a lot, so remember to come back and you have to come back for our grad. You have to or else you we're never to. talking again. Yeah, but we love you and text me often. Hi Maddie! So how's equine? <laughs> no, but we miss you. We will miss you so and much. We love you, and we're gonna miss having you mm -hmm. as our neighbor. neighbor. And You're actually the best neighbor. Ever. Yes, thank you for putting up with us <laughs> and all of the noises that. No, we're super. Quiet. Yeah, no. But I loved having you in my math class. You really brought diversity into my math. And I love you for that, and I love you as a person. And we love you! We love you! We love you. Thank you for getting lunches with me. Mm -hmm. I'm lonely. Hey, Maddie. Have fun. I love you. Hey, Mac. You're one of the few reasons.
reasons I survived swim season and I'm so glad I stayed in this sport and I'm so grateful for the bond we made and I'm gonna miss you so much. Mac, I just wanna say you are so kind and I had so much fun um, in our sophomore workshops with you and you really made it so much better and you made my year and I wish you well in college and I know you're gonna do great. We love you! Hi Mac! Um, I am already know that I'm going to miss you so much, and I know that we've just gotten closer this year, but you're still one of my favorite seniors of all time, and my favorite memories with you are every time that we have a door meeting, you get those little packets of carrots, and you always feed me random snacks while I'm walking around the dorm, and I love you very much, and I hope you have a great life. <laughs> Kiss. Bye! Kiss. Hi, Mac. Uh, just wanted to say that you have been one of my favorite people in this dorm. Uh, I consider you my senior, and I'm really going to miss you next year, and I hope you do great in Purdue, but I wanted to share one of my favorite moments with you, and that is when you would come to my room, and we would go walk to rowing together, and I feel like we had a lot of fun memories just being able to talk, and my favorite memory is, no one's really going to get the reference, but when we were walking, and we saw some of the guys in the field just doing their thing, and you made a, a primal instinct joke about them bringing you food and to this day it's still one of my favorite jokes that you've ever made and I laugh every time I think about it and I'm really gonna miss you. Bye! Angela! I'm super sad you're not gonna be in the dorm next year but I wish you all the best at UCLA next year. You're gonna do great. You're super smart. It'll be cool. Yay California. I am sad that I won't get to bother you on Dormin anymore, but I am honored that I was the only sophomore you talked to last year, so. Love you! Hi Angela, I'm gonna miss you so much, you were literally the best, like, carefree roommate ever, and thank you for being so chill and dealing with me all year, I love you much. Hi, Brie. Hi. Okay, so this is our <laughs> senior tribute video to you, and I just wanted to say that I love you, and I'm so grateful through, or for everything that you've done for me this year, and about how much that I've gotten to know you through all of my horrible experiences the past <laughs> few months, but thank you for being there for me and being the best honor up and dorm chair Benson could ever have. Thank you for being my big sister, and you were um, a great honor rep. Crest lessons were always very fun as a new girl, especially in your room when we would always get sidetracked and start laughing. Um, yeah, and taking me to town for the first time at breakfast. Thank you for letting me invade your room like almost every night. I'm sorry about that. Uh, we're gonna absolutely miss you. It was great to always spend time with you, and I always loved your like sarcastic comments. <laughs> we love you. Bye. Bye. making a video for you right now because obviously you're my favorite senior. Um, I've known you since forever, even back when we were playing tennis and like when I was like seven or something. And coming to Culver was really nice having you here because you made it feel like home. You were like a familiar face that I had known for a while. And like I know we were never super close before, but I think we really like connected over the past two years when you crested me and all of that stuff. It was really fun. And I've always loved having you here. You are the only reason I got through Otters, pre Otters Algebra 2. I, I would have failed without you, basically. Um, so yeah, thank you. You're great. Um, it's kind of funny, the timing that I'm recording this right now. But happy graduation. And I am beyond happy for you that you got into MIT because you deserve it more than anyone. And it has been a pleasure getting to know you over the past three years, you, me, and Faith. I think it's been a blessing most of the time. <laughs> I'm joking, but um, it has been great getting to know you, and thanks for being my friend. Hi, seniors. We just wanted to take a quick moment to tell you how much we appreciate all that you've done to make Benson the lovely home it was this year, and how great it was <laughs> to work with you all as leaders. You did an amazing job. I want to say this is an emotional time for you and all of us, okay? 
So just remember, when someone te tells you or asks you, is your kilt rolled? You know what I mean? Think about it. Might not be wearing a kilt, but is your skirt rolled? Are you showing everybody what you got? You know what I'm saying? Anyways, oh, she's laughing. Anyways, um, I think that you all are going to do well in this united world of ours. Go out and conquer, because you're a Benson girl. I didn't mean to do like, yeah, I did, I guess, so sorry. Anyways, um, so remember, roll up your socks. Oh, Ruby's barking. You're gonna miss that, right, May? <laughs> Anyways, um, I want to tell each and every one of you, don't be afraid to do something that you're not used to doing. Ex experience, if you haven't experienced it, you should be afraid, right? Yeah. All right. Oh, there's Ruby again. It's Anyways. okay to be afraid and still do something new, still try it. Exactly, okay? So, you're not gonna have someone there, a dorm mom or a counselor right up your butt to say, did you go to class, <laughs> right? Aren't yeah. You, yeah? yeah. Or, hey, how come you were late to class? Or, did you go to breakfast? You're gonna be saying, I don't have to do any of those things, but guess what? You're gonna look and see. You're gonna be like, God, I really miss that. We will miss you. And we will forever cherish all the memories we made with you all. Yes, okay? We love you. Love you. Bye. Bye.